Hi guys, it's Shannon with uh, Studio 19. I just wanted to come on today and share something with you that it took me a long time to figure out. Um, it's painting white furniture. When you paint white furniture, you will run into something called bleed through. And as you can see on my piece, especially in this one spot right here, I'm not sure exactly what that was, um, but it is definitely bleeding through. Um, some other examples like right here, you can see that's bleeding through. Um, the best solution I found, um, Jamie Ray Vintage selected it. If you haven't seen any of her videos, they're amazing, so go watch those. It's J-A-M-I, Jamie Ray. But this is what... I found that works and what you will do is you'll just take your can and I've already put a little bit on here and you'll just spray it on all those places that you think might have a little bit of bleed through and I have a few that I feel like need just that little bit of sealer sorry for the mess guys this is my studio this is where I paint things. You can see in the back I'm working on sneak peek. Almost finished. Um, I feel like on this side that uh, it's it's pretty well covered. I mean, I still have to maybe some no, I still have to sand and distress. And um, this piece is old. It's a solid oak cabinet. Um, I'm not really sure what kind of paint finish they had on it, but I've noticed a few little imperfections and here's the thing using chalk paint you usually don't have any prep so basically you skip the sanding and the stripping and all that but key your piece that you paint will only be as good as the paint finish underneath so because I'm going to distress this I will go back to these pieces that need to be fixed that I didn't get the first time. Sometimes it's a lot easier to see them when uh, you get it painted. Um, one more quick little key. If you're going to paint white furniture, uh, make sure your lighting is good because I have painted white furniture and then taken it out in the sunlight and only realized then that I had bleed through. Also, one more thing. If you're going to paint white furniture, do not use polyurethane. It will yellow your piece. Um, polyacrylic, um, which is water-based, will not usually, maybe sometimes, but definitely uh, not polyurethane. Um, I, don't ask me how I know that. I learned that the hard way. Um, but I hope you guys have a great uh, Thanksgiving weekend as we finish it up on Sunday. I'm out here painting and just having a little bit of fun. So, I hope you guys enjoyed these little tips on painting white furniture. Y'all have a good weekend. Thanks.